those people are never going to see a penny. And you know who's going to pay for that? We are. The taxpayers of the Commonwealth. For this multi-billion dollar corporation that just walks away after they leave the destruction. The destruction here, even if it never has an accident, will be detrimental to our health, like in a big way. Detrimental to our safety, detrimental to our quality of life. The noise and the smells that are gonna come from that thing are gonna be really, really bad. So $10 million, really? That's like five cents to a company like this. So we want to encourage the mayor, don't sign. Do not sign on the dotted line. Do not take the $10 million. And it's hard. It's hard. We're going into, and I'm, I'm a financial person, so I'm going to say it. We're going into a depression. We're going into a financial situation that most of us have never seen in our lives. Some people have. But the town is going to be looking for money, 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 wherever they can possibly get it. And so you can understand. You can say, okay, someone comes and gives you a bag of money. This is what you say to Enbridge. We'll take your money. That's all. We're not going to sign anything. Thanks for the money, guys. We'll pay off our law bills now and go forward a little bit. That's what you do. Because Enbridge is going to ask for the devil's bargain. And so we need to encourage Headland not to take that bargain. So thank you for being here on this beautiful sunny day. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to embarrass Debbie Brown. Happy birthday, Deb. Where is she? And I'm going to pass this, I'm going to wipe it down, and I'm going to pass this to Reverend Betsy to ground us. One big rule, and I think I've tried to talk to everyone, you can beep and yell and do whatever you want as we go around Calpine. As we're headed to Town Hall, and when we are at Town Hall, we will be silent. No horns, no yelling. No music. No music. You can flash, you know, have your lights flashing, but we're going to be silent. I have a question. Yes, well, should we be carrying our smartphones with us during these actions because now they're anonymously tracking us? Does anybody? <laughs> I have a bad attitude. Should she said, should we be we carrying our smartphones with us as we're doing these actions because they're like following us? They've been following us for all this time. Yeah. And you know what I say? <laughs> I say, good for you. Bring it on. So, <laughs> You know, that's totally up to you. Okay. You know, if you feel unsafe or whatever, turn your phone off. Um, but it, it, you know what? As my son says to me, Mom, if you think you have any privacy what, whatsoever, you're joking <laughs> yourself. <I> go, okay. <laughs> so you might as well just be out there. Thanks for asking, though, MJ. So silence as we go to town hall, silence at town hall, flashers. And then after we've done our three paces around town hall, disperse and have a lovely day. Thank but you. But I'm going to pass this to Reverend Betsy to ground us before we go. Thanks, Alice. Thank you. love the 
earth and its creatures that we are all bound up with. Take another deep breath. And know that we are one. We are one. And we go 